on and we're using it to stream so yeah that's a off to the great start we're gonna have this is totally gonna go out lila's convinced though that it's that i'm going to love sewing i don't i feel like i'm gonna hate it because i'm really bad with like hand-eye coordination in this kind of context like things like crocheting or like <gasps> origami i love origami but do you like I to suck. crochet I tried to and I gave up because I couldn't figure out how to make the knot. My okay, to we teaching. have to, let's do crocheting too after this. You know how to? Yeah, I used to, okay, so I, we used to make little cell phone cases. Cell phone cases? Yeah, oh, like, like crochet phone, them? Yeah, crochet little like cell phone pouches and it had like a little handle. That's cute. I had like 30 of them. Yeah, I was like my favorite thing. And we used to crochet like uh, scarves. This I used to do this when I was like 13. And then, um, like a scarf. <laughs> we, uh, the things I used to like sewing was uh, scrunchies and headbands. Okay, there's... I'm excited. This sewing kit is brand new, so there's still like... Yeah, we literally just unboxed it. I've had it laying around for like, I don't even know how long, maybe like a year or so. And I've never used it because I've never sewn before. I've only sewed things by hand. Like the patch that's on Sean's jacket, I sewed that on by hand. And it was really hard because it was like this thick. It would have been much better with a sewing machine, but... We have directions here, which we're gonna have to use. Um, I think we all know how me well, following directions goes. Here's the thing. I've never actually set up a sewing machine before. I've only used one that was already in operation. Oh, okay. So this is the first time for me as well. Got it. So we're both we're, learning stuff like you said yeah we're learning but this is so cool how exciting i didn't expect lila to be this excited over sewing i am so excited and you have so many colors and strings oh look at this see all these colors and strings i've made i used to, i took a home ec class when i was in high school and i learned how to make pants and little sweatpants that's mostly what I mean. Literally sweatshop. Yeah, I'm in a sweatshop right now. Brittany's sweatshop. Someone asked what model this was. Um, Brother GX37. We need a, like a tool. What do you need? Like a, oh here, what's this? That's a, what is that actually? Oh, it worked. <laughs> it was great. It looks you like, know a what? Tooth, it's like a tooth, like a It's a threading thing. And it's a cutter, oh. Where did it drop? Underneath you. There. We need it because this is like a little stabby device, so you want to put it back in here so it doesn't. Okay. You don't stab yourself or someone else. Well, maybe I want to stab someone else. Joking, YouTube staff. Joking. <laughs> okay. I've almost got this. Okay. I almost got all the sticky parts off. Okay. And then oh, this part is off. Okay. So it's been unwrapped. Okay, there's string in here already. Does that mean? Okay. Oh, wow. Okay, this is so cool. There's different types of stitches on here that we can do. You see? Yeah. Maybe. Let me show them. Look at these stitches. You see? All these different types. How cool. What do they mean? Um, I don't really know. I know the zigzag one's supposed to like reinforce more. That's what I heard on TikTok. But these TikTok tutorials for like crocheting, it's so funny. I posted on my Instagram the other day. It was this, it was the making fun of crocheting tutorials. It was like, here's how it looks to a beginner. We're gonna put this through the whole D, suck my balls, lick my dick. And then we're going, and then I'm going to perfect. Oh, you almost saw me put it through the crochet hole. Oh, well, let me put my hand here so you can't see where I'm putting the next thing. I thought it was so funny. Okay, so first we have to get our string, which means we have to open this thing with my little pokey stick. I'll use this pokey stick. Okay, I'm gonna open this up. I want to tell you about the scary movie I watched, but I have to concentrate and do this first. Okay. I watched a really scary movie last night, and I can't wait to tell you guys about it. I'll tell you all about it, and um, then you don't have to watch it. It's going to be a spoiler. Literally, like, a too long didn't read, but verbalized for movies. Yeah. Um, okay, uh, I don't know how to open this. 
you need, do you know how to open this box? Um, how many women does it take to open a box? <laughs> okay. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Can get a... Okay, look at how cute this is, you guys. And you see how it has like little compartments. Oh, oh, let me show you guys what we're sewing today. So you guys are wondering probably what we're sewing today. And I have a lot of patches. So I wanted to sew some patches onto different things. Like I have a pink jacket. I want to make a bimbo jacket. And then I have some tote bags. So let me show you guys Where's the my tool? patches. Okay. Okay. okay, let me show you. This damn thing is not open. Hey, JC. Thank you for being a subscriber for nine months. Hi, JC. So these are the patches. I really like some of these. Some of them I got from Etsy. This one says Troubled Youth. I like my edgy patches. Okay. Come and take it. That's so cute. Extra trust. Extra terrestrial highway. Why can't I say that? I could say it in my head. You know what? I think aliens are all the rage. Yeah, they're very trendy right now. This one's definitely going on the jacket. Oh, I just figured out how to open this, I think. Oh, you did? No, I didn't. <laughs> okay. It's like real, oh, oh, yeah, I did. You got it? <gasps> okay, this is the most complicated box. First of all, would you think that you would open it like this? You see? No. You would think you would be opening from the top right here, right? No, but look, it's you, you do this. Then you do that. Yeah. Now it's open. I would not have thought that. Okay, hold on. I have to get the pizza. Stay here. Okay. I will talk to them about the colors. We're having pizza. I'm so excited. But yeah, I have a bunch of cool patches. I'll show you guys more when I get back. I okay. I get the pizza. I figured out how to open this box. Now I am going to read the directions. I'm going to put this on your stick. Okay. So let's just use... I'll just put this white one on for now. Okay. Oh my God, this is so cute. Wait, look. I'm getting old. I'll find it. Okay. So you guys, you see this? And then open, it opens like this. It has all these different compartments. Um, there you go, all these different compartments. Anyways. Okay, I have to figure out how to set up this machine because it's brand new. Hold on, it fell. Okay. I'm gonna use this. I will show you guys the machine. Mm -hmm. Okay. It is like a tackle box. Good observation. Okay, so it says, pull up the stool pin completely, which I think is this, if you guys wanna see what I'm doing. So it told me to pull this thing up completely, which I just did. Now, pull the thread completely. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna put, I'll put this guy on there. Okay, like my nails? Okay. Looks like cat claws. Okay. So then I have to take it and um, kind of zigzag it through. I don't really know. Okay, how does it work? Have I ever told you how much I hate DoorDash drivers? Why? I'm by this place and he's not. Hold on, I have to tab out. Okay. Nice stream. See, I can't tell if you're being a little shit or if you're being genuine. Okay. I'm trying to get the get the pizza. The, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back down. Okay. I'm gonna try to figure this out. So align the top. Align the notch to the spring on the shaft. On the shaft? I think we Not need- the shaft. Oh, I think these, there's a whole, there's a whole bunch of tools that we need to use. Make sure you guys like this video, okay? 
There's 135 of you in here, which means there should be 135 likes on this, and there's only 73 right now. So, um, it says to align the top notch. I think that's this. This thing? Okay. Um, okay. I don't know. I think we're missing a tool. Oh, is it this? Is it this thing? Okay. Is it this? I think this might be it. Brittany went to go get pizza. She's coming back. Don't worry. Okay. Ah! Oh, crap. Okay. So, align the top notch to the spring on the shaft. I think it's, I think it's that. Okay, click it. Now, what? Okay, so we have to take this. Oh, okay, I have to take, oh, I need to put that through. I need a needle. Yay! Awesome. Thanks, Brittany. Brittany's back. She has the pizza and she's back. Okay, I figured out something, but not entirely. Okay. Okay, so we had to put this piece on. Now we have to, I'm gonna need a needle or something. A needle? There should be a bunch of needles in here. Okay, perfect. We have a needle. Okay, so we have to get. I'll set this patch. Okay, we have to like put this through the hole. And I feel like I'll use this. down by eating a slice of pizza yeah this has been super difficult we this is what i've done look oh you put the okay so here's what she's doing guys she put the thread through the sewing needle thing okay and then i think i have to put this how okay where's my directions okay then we have to but i'm where's number Spectral Citizen, $5. Starbucks looking patch is dope. Love when you ladies stream together. Thank you, Spectral. Thanks, Spectral. Spectral's the best. Okay, so I have to put this little string into this slight small hole. Okay. Wow. It's so hard to do. Okay, I'm going to. Thank you. To, to cut it because it that little that little piece of hair it's like a okay okay I'm I'll show you guys the patches after I eat hold on I'm trying to get it into this hole okay I did it ha ha you see how difficult that is oh that's so cute it's perfect look how cute and small it is yeah, and then I get a regular sized one. <laughs> okay, so, oh my gosh, I can't believe I figured this out. So we put that in there. Then we push this down. Wait, what? Align the notch to the spring on the shaft. Okay, there it is. Then, okay. Uh, 
then it should go down. Okay, I put it in there. Now, okay, now it says, okay, five. Yeah, it's pepperoni pizza. It's kind of cold. I'm kind of tempted to just like clean my air fryer. I don't like cold pizza. Okay, but four. Fold the thread of. Okay. What's the chat yes. saying? It's saying this ain't gonna end well. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you guys can't see this, but I'm gonna bring it up so you can see it. This is the thing I have to step on because now the next part says I need to step on it and have this somehow do something. But so while it's short, so we have to like put the little steppy thing yeah. like higher mm -hmm. up on a box. This is supposed to click into this. Like so, oh, oh I figured it out. Kind of. Uh, I don't know. Okay, hold on. It, okay, that says. Okay, it said it's supposed to click. I'm putting mine in the air fryer. Pull the thread. Okay, I don't. Let me just let me just see if this will work. I'm gonna. Oh look! But it's going backwards. Oh, wait. Oh, look. Oh, got I, I don't. It. I don't know what. I mean, it's doing something. It's doing something. It's going around that like a bunch. Okay. So, wound the thread a few times around the bobbin. The, what oh, the fuck is a bobbin? This is bobbin. I found it in that case. Bobbin and weaving. Okay. Why? Wind, wind the thread few times around the bobbin. Now number five. When the bobbin is full, the bobbin will spin slowly. Okay, I guess we let's just do let's just keep doing I, it. Yeah, I think you have to do it till this is filled because it's like a little um look at it. <laughs> That's kinda cool. How many times? So you put the so you put this here and then you wrapped it around and where did you put this part? On the top? I, I put it through this hole. You see how it's in that hole? Yeah. Okay, and then it, I'm supposed to cut this in a little bit. Okay. Okay, but let, let's just keep doing it for a while. Dan Holland, five pounds. Huge opportunity for Brittany to be taught how to sew oh, by it, a future president. Hashtag landslide Lila, hashtag have a heart. Okay, it broke, so I don't know if he, what that was for or if we need it. If we need it. Remember when that chat said it's not gonna go well? <laughs> I mean, I, I think it's supposed to, I think that's okay. <laughs> you don't have to fill the whole thing. No, but it's because it says, it says cut it, so, but. Yeah, it just means it's not a, it's gonna be as filled as you want it to be. And okay, you're gonna have to replace well. it quicker, probably. I, okay, well, okay, hold on. So, we take out it's numbers okay do you, do you want oh i know what this is for now oh look this already has something in there i think this is you know what i think this is you know what i think i did what? i think this is what you use to make this little thing that's already in there you see yeah so we're done with that i think <laughs> Okay, so then you take, cause they look, cause you're supposed to, people can see these directions, eh? you're supposed to take this little thing out, right? And then you put it in here, but there's already a little spooly thing in there, which means that's good. Okay. So if there's something already in there, what does that mean? 200 watts studio, five dollars per chat. I thought sewing, cooking, and cleaning were instinctual for women. Oh yeah, we just get popped right out and we just, it's like a dog oh, knowing how to doggy me. paddle, you know? Okay, turn the lever. Okay, so number. So oh, thank you Spectral for telling me the $100 uh, donation from strongwoman97. 
I like how the 97 too. This nice little touch. Stop eating pizza every day, fat so. Listen, I purposely wore this crop top to make sure that I don't eat more than a couple of slices, okay? Brittany looks great. Okay. But thank you. Okay, I'm so confused. Strong woman 97. We're being very strong women. I think, hold on. Where's this shade come from? Oh, it's coming from the light. That's annoying. I don't think that was supposed to break. I think I needed that. Oh, I see it. It's just in there and it's, okay, you know what? Where's my little tool? I see my little guy. So you need to pull the string out of there? I see it. You see that little string? It's like right there and it popped. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if I could Will pull. tweezers help? No. Yeah, maybe tweezers will out. Okay. I don't know how much of this we can really like pull, but yeah, we need tweezers. You see this? Cause it snaps. Okay, we're figuring it out. It's working, guys. Here you go. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I got this. Let's do it. Lila said that she saw this French movie she was excited to tell me about. Yeah, it's called um, The Vanishing, and it was filmed in 1988. You want me to, how about we, I'm going to eat pizza and take a little break and tell you about the movie, okay? Okay. Okay, so I watched this movie last night with Eric, and it, oh my gosh. Okay, so let me tell you what the movie was about. It was about this guy named Rexford and his girlfriend named Saskia, or Sas Swastika, or something. We'll call her Swastika. Anyway, so him and Swastika, Rexford and Sas Swast Saska. is that a name? In French? Yes, this is a French movie. So, him and his girlfriend, we're going on a road trip together, okay? So they had their little car, and on top of their car, they had their bicycles. In the beginning of the movie, Brittany, they're going through this tunnel. It's like a dark tunnel. First, it's like light, and then they go through like a tunnel, like through like a mountain. In the middle of the tunnel, they run out of gas. And of course, Sasta gets upset with Rexford. She's like, oh my gosh, you should have. This is all in French, by the way. I'm just reading the subtitles. She was like, oh my gosh, you should have listened to me and gotten gas back there when we had the opportunity to get gas. Now we don't have gas in our car and because the car is completely dead and they're in this dark tunnel and like a car could just hit them, you know? Yeah. And so they're sitting there and obviously then this big truck comes and it's about to like hit them and it swerves and misses them. So he's like, well, we need to walk through this tunnel and go get gas. And she was like, let me find my flashlight. So she's like digging Wait, through. Wait, how old's this movie? Why didn't they just use their phone? It's 1988, they didn't have okay. phones, okay? So, but for me, I'm like, why didn't they just take their bikes off of the top of the thing and like ride out of the tunnel? But that's not what they did. So she's like digging back there. Immediate plot hole. Yeah. She's digging back there looking for this flashlight. And he was like, I'm leaving. And he just leaves her to go to the gas station. Okay. So he leaves and he comes back and he has gas and she's not in the car, but he puts the gas in and he drives out of the tunnel. And she's like standing there with the flashlight, like looking like furious, like, oh my gosh, you just like left me and I was like so scared. Yeah, okay. I would be mad too. Yeah, she was so mad. But whatever, they got their gas and they went to this like, um, kind of like this like rest stop area where like a bunch of other travelers. Um, Do you want me to reheat your pizza? No, it's okay. So, um, they go back to, yeah, maybe you should reheat it. Okay. Okay, so. They get to this rest stop area, and it's where a bunch of travelers are at. And she goes inside, and she buys like a frisbee or something. And she comes out with the frisbee, and he's like pissed that she spent all this money on the frisbee because apparently it was like kind of expensive for the frisbee. Okay, my version's back. I'm, I'm immersed again. Okay, woman buys something, man gets mad about it. Okay. Okay. So, so then. And she's like, you need to relax a little bit. Besides, like, this frisbee is, like, fun. Like, we can, like, play with it while we're stretching our legs. And she's like, um, I think their relationship is, like, fairly new. Maybe they've only been together for, like, three months, you know? But she was like, don't ever leave me again. Like, that was so, made me so sad and blah, blah, blah. So they have this, like, passionate, like, little moment where they kiss. And he's like, I will never leave you again. And Wait, so he got hung up about a frisbee? Mm-hmm. How much was the frisbee? A quarter in 1988? Like, $13. In 1988. Maybe, I think it was like 13 French something. So maybe it was like two to five dollars. Oh, I don't okay. know. That makes sense. So anyway. So then she was like, she was like, 
I want to drive the car the rest of the trip. And he was like, you've never driven on the highway before, but it's okay, like, fine, I'll let you drive. And she's, like, all excited because she gets to drive the car, right? So he hands her his keys, and Linda's Britannia is, like, on this, like, little key ring. And she grabs the key ring, and she's like, ugh, this is, like, so ugly. Like, why do you have this, such the ugliest, like, keychain on this key ring? So true. Yeah, she was like, this is so ugly. So she takes the key ring and the keys and then she's like okay i'm gonna go inside and get us um i'm gonna get a coke and i'll get you a beer and he was like okay and she's like i'm taking the keys with me haha <laughs> because i get to drive the car now so he's like all happy and she goes into um the gas station to like buy the drinks right so he's just tolerating her at this point because he wants to get laid that's what it sounds like to me i'm sure okay so <laughs> so then he like takes a polaroid picture <laughs> he takes a polaroid of the car and he like writes on it he was like um, Saska is first time driving or whatever. She's going to drive this car for the rest of their trip. Okay. And, um, he's like waiting there and he's like waiting and waiting and waiting. And like, she just doesn't come back. And he's like, what the hell? Like, where is she? So he goes into the gas station. And he like, can't find her. Like, she's like missing. And not only is she missing, she has the keys. So he's just um, like stuck with the car, right? Maybe she's getting payback. So, <laughs> so then he like writes this note on the car and he like leaves it on the car. And he was like, um, so I got wait in the car. I'm looking for you. Okay. Cause I don't have cell phones. Okay? So he writes on the personal card. And he's like looking for her. And then he's like talking to people. And then he notices on the Polaroid that there she is like standing in the Polaroid. And there's like a guy behind her. And he was like, wait, so like she did come out and like something must've happened. I'm like, where is she? Like, did somebody take her? And he's, like, freaking out at this point. Okay? So then he goes and he finds, like, the, um... Somebody. Hold on, I gotta get your pizza. So he finds somebody in, like, the back and he tells him, he's like, hey, I think my girlfriend has been kidnapped or something. Like, please help me. And they're like, dude, like, we can't do anything. And did you guys get into a fight or something? They don't believe him, obviously. Well... This was, like, the funniest part. It's not funny, but it was, like, sad. He was, like, ah, oh, the bikes! And then he went out, and all of his shit was stolen, and the bikes and, like, all this stuff. I thought this was France. Is this France in 2023, or? Because that's what it sounds like. <laughs> so, um, all their stuff is, like, completely stolen, when right? One of your pizzas... One of your pizza slices came out fancy. I'm sorry. It's okay. It came out in cursive. It looks good. I'm excited. So... Now, fast forward three years later, she's been missing for three years, okay? So now we're wow. fast forward to three years. And this guy is just, like, looking for her, and he, like, will not give up looking for her. He's, like, putting out posters, like, everywhere, okay? Then it shows this other character, Raymond. Now, Raymond is this, like, professor guy. That doesn't sound like a French name, is it? His name is Raymond. So... He's, like, this professor guy, right? And you kind of, like, find out about his family. Like, he has a family, and he has this, like, property, and it kind of shows, like, the backstory that, like, he always, like, wanted to kidnap <laughs> somebody. <laughs> Excuse me. Continue. So, Raymond was, is the kidnapper here in this part, okay? Okay. So, it, like, it goes back to, like, his life. He's, like, a, he has two daughters and a um, wife, and he has, like, this big, beautiful house, and then he also has this, like, other property, which is, like, a scary property, because that's where he's going to take his victims, you know? Yeah. So, it's that, like, it goes, like, a behind the, um, like, years prior to, like, Raymond, like, plotting, like, how he's going to, like, kidnap somebody, okay? <laughs> At one point, he, you know, he takes the chloroform, and he, like, chloroforms himself because he wants to know how long it will knock him out. Like, he does, because he's a professor. He does, like, all these, like, tests, and he's like, okay, um, this will knock me out for, like, 18 minutes. So, like, when I go kidnap somebody, I have 18 minutes to get them in the car and, like, get them to my place, right? So... Now, let's go back to Rex. Rex, he's, like, he has a new girlfriend, by the way. Now he has a new girlfriend, but he's still, like, putting up all these, like, wanted posters. And Wait, Ray that's weird, though. Okay, so if you have a boyfriend, and something happened to your girlfriend, they're presumably dead, and then they're still thinking about her, like, rent-free. I don't know, like, I get why. No, it gets, really, no it gets really funny. It gets really funny. So, well, it's not funny, but it is. Um, so, in one scene... So Raymond starts sending Rexford like uh, postcards, like being like, "Oh, I'm like I'm the killer, and like meet me at this place." And like for three years, he watches like Rexford like meet him at different places, but he like doesn't show up. He just like sends him on like a, you know like a mouse trail, okay? Yeah. And then he just like watches him and just, like because he wants to like tell him what happened to Saska. And like this whole time, I'm thinking like, where? So is the guy who kidnapped him wants to tell him? Yes, who kidnapped his girlfriend wants to tell him. But, like, he, so he keeps sending him, like, postcards because he's a crazy person. Anyways, so he sends him a postcard, and 
um, Rexford and his new girlfriend go to this like place and she's like, I'm, I'm, I'm done with this. Like his new girlfriend, she's like, I've had it. Like, she's like gone. Like, can you just like let it go? And he was like, no, I can't let it go. Like, you know, I just need to know what happened to her. And basically <laughs> at one point, this is the saddest part. He was like, if she was to show up right now, I'd still choose you. But honestly, I wish I could just go back to the gas station. And if, if I if I was allowed to like choose like with my life, like I was I was just back at the gas station with her and she never got stolen. Wow, I uh I I have no words. So anyways, she goes around with him and like helps him like put up all these posters or whatever. Wait, after that? Yeah, like she's still having put up Pick posters. Me. Okay. So then Rexford goes to the news and he goes to the news and he's like, hey, listen here, you little freako who's sending me these postcards. Like, I want to know where you're at and I want to know what you did with Sasuke and, you know, I don't like you, but tell me what happened to my girl. He goes to the news, okay? Now we go back to Raymond. He's like watching this with his like family, like, ha ha ha. The like, chat is concerned your pizza is going to get cold again. Oh yeah, should I take a bite? I'm just getting so excited about telling you this story because I want to get to the juicy part. So... Oh, it's already getting juicy. Like oh, this girl, juicy. this girl is like, no, it's fine. You could just treat me like crap. So finally, she's completely fed up. She's like, I can't deal with this. Oh no, no, this is where I forgot this whole part. So she's like, can we like stop like looking for this girl, please? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> He's like, okay, let's go somewhere on vacation. So they go somewhere, right? But they go. She does not realize she accidentally takes him to the place where he was supposed to originally go on the road trip with Swaska. So when he gets there, he has this like full blown like panic attack where he just can't, he just like starts collapsing on the ground. Cause he was like, this is where I was supposed to go with her before she got like kidnapped, you know? So she has a, a meltdown. I mean, he has a meltdown and she's just like, I can't fucking take this anymore. Like, do you sure. like she just went dry. Yeah. She was like, I just can't take this anymore. Like, a man crying like a little girl she's like yo i just have to leave you I, I just can't. it's it's really like that meme that people always talk about like if a woman sees a guy cry they like lose attraction for them <laughs> so she's like she's like i can't i can't take this anymore i'm leaving so then so then there's a scene she leaves or whatever raymond the kidnapper is like i'm ready to approach rexford because he's been sending him postcards for like three years you know so finally, like he's like, okay, he's too dumb to figure it out. So, it, it, well, it's not, it wasn't that he was too dumb. It was just like he kept. It'd be like if I was like sending you a postcard. I'm like, Brittany, meet me at the mall, but, and well, then I show you show up at the mall, and I just like watch you, but I don't like actually come up to you. But isn't part of the excitement supposed to be like, oh, there's a chance he could figure it out? Um, uh, yeah, you're probably right. You're probably right. But I think he just got Raymond, the kidnapper. He just really liked that. Rex was like so passionate about finding Swastika. Okay. okay. He was like, <laughs> Swastika, that's her name. Uh, he was like, so he's like, wow, like I love the dedication that he just like wants to find his woman. Mm -hmm. Right? And also, when he already has a woman. Well, he has a new woman, but here's the thing that's really, that sucks for the new girl is like, first of all, you cannot compete with a ghost. Okay? The, uh, look, their relationship ended after like three months of bliss and then she got kidnapped so it's like in his mind it was like the perfect relationship except like she just got kidnapped you know yeah and so then this new girl comes in they were together for like eight months my favorite anime has this premise mm. it's the same premise of like the love triangle and you can't compete with the ghost inuyasha yeah it was so funny because at one point in the video in the movie she was like i don't want to be in this menage a trois anymore i can't take it anymore and she said it in french yeah she said menage a trois <laughs> so i think that means like some sort of love triangle. Threesome. Oh, okay. Well, you know. So, um, she leaves. Now Raymond's like, goes to where Rexford lives, okay? And he's like, this is where I was going. <laughs> so, Rexford comes down outside. This is after his breakup with the new girl. Okay. No, Raymond's standing there. And Raymond, like, taps him on the shoulder. <laughs> he's like, it's me. I'm the one you're, you've been looking for. I've been the one that's been, like, sending you the postcards. And he's like, if you get in my car and come with me to France... I will tell you what happened to Sasuke. And he was like, he just starts beating the shit out of him. But Wait, like the, the boyfriend? Yeah. He just starts beating up Raymond, which is like, in this moment, he should have just killed him. Like, <laughs> you just... But what if she's still alive? Exactly. So that's my part. I was like, what if she's still alive? So he's like beating him up. And then um, Raymond's like, if you... 
he's like, if you, there's nothing you can do. Like, even if you try to tell the police it was me, like, there's no way there's any evidence of it. So either you come with me or I, I'm never going to talk to you again. And then Rexford is like, fuck it. Like, I'm just going to go with him. So he gets in the car with him. This is the part of the funny deal. Raymond was like, I made snacks. Like, I have snacks. <laughs> there's a Are they poison? <laughs> he made sandwiches. And he's like, you know, this is a long road trip. And then Raymond begins to tell Rexford his, like, life story. So basically, when he was 17, Raymond, like, jumped off of a building. Like, just, like, jumped off a building because he's a psychopath. He was like, that's when I knew I was a psychopath because I was standing at the ledge of this building. And then I was like, should I jump? And I listened to that voice in my head. I was like, yeah, just do it. Just jump. So he jumped. And he had his arm in a cast. And then he was like, I'm a psychopath. Then he went on to have, like, a family or whatever. But he was like, I always knew I was the psychopath. And then he goes on to tell him how he wanted to kidnap somebody. And he, like, they're driving. He's, like, telling him this. The whole time I'm thinking, like, why doesn't, like, Rexford just, like, stab him in the neck or, like, punch him in the head? Like, why are you just listening to this? But then, like you said, because he wants to know, like, is she alive, you know? He should have just asked, is she alive? He says yes or no. And he just takes the wheel and just kills them all. Well, he kept asking that, and he was like, just come with me to France, and I will tell you. I will let you know what happened. Like, you just have to right. come with me. So then, this is the part where it gets, like, really fucked up. He tells him about how he originally, like, he tells him all the different times he was, like, trying to kidnap people because he wasn't supposed to kidnap Swaska. There was, like, so many girls in between that just, like, got away, okay? And, like, oh, this is so upsetting. So it takes the time where at the, they're at the gas station, right? He says he sees Swastika and... Rexford like pull in and they're all like romantic and happy and he was like I really wanted to kidnap her because I could tell you guys were in love and stuff and I didn't like that and I wanted to take her because he's like this is what he was saying he's like I know it would have been easy to like kidnap a prostitute but like I wanted to kidnap somebody that would be difficult to get so oh my he, god that's his inner male speaking yes he wanted to get someone that would be difficult to get it's so, like it's like when a guy says I don't want a relationship and then you're like okay then no more contact, by, And then they're like, no way! Because they want to be the one to reject you. It's that same kind of concept. Oh gosh, it gets so crazy. So then, so it shows where she walks in and she buys the frisbee. That's where he like notices her at first. Oh, also by the way, um, just to rewind a little bit, Raymond was like trying to kidnap a bunch of people, but like it wasn't working. So then he saw a picture of himself when he was 17 and his arm was broken. He was like, oh, I need to look like I'm hurt so that I'll look more approachable. And I was like, oh my God. So he had like a little like fake like, Thing on his arm so he looked like a nice person which just goes to show you just because someone dis is disabled doesn't mean that they're like automatically nice okay they could still be like you could be a bitch in a wheelchair just saying okay anyways <laughs> side story so um he watches her go into the freaking place to buy a frisbee and he's like oh i want to take her but then like all these kids swarm him and he's not able to get her so then he sees this other girl walk in there and he's like oh she'll do so he, he goes outside with this girl and he, um, his plan was to tell them that he needed, like, help, like, latching something to his car. And he's like, this oh. is the actual trafficking method, yes. by the way. So he was like, get in my car. And she, the girl gets in. And so this is what he was going to do. When the girl gets in the car, he would walk around the car, put, like, some chloroform and, like, a little thingy. And then, like, his plan was to, like, reach behind, lock the thing, and be like, ah! And Aww. chloroform them. Okay? So he has a girl. Finally, after all these attempts, he finally has a girl in his car. He gets in, and he starts hyperventilating he get, he's getting scared he's like i don't know if i can do this he like fucking freaks out and like he bails okay so he just like bails and then the girl's like what the fuck like <laughs> okay she just leaves and he goes inside and he like splashes his face with water like oh my god i don't, i was so close but like i couldn't do it i couldn't do it then he sees swastika go back in the in back in the gas station because remember it earlier in the movie she was going back in the gas station to buy a beer and a, a coke uh -huh. and she talks to him Brittany, oh. and she talks to him, and she's like, oh, do you have, like, change for this or that or whatever, and they start talking, and she's talking in French, but she's not really good at French. I think they're from Amsterdam or something, and he's okay. like, oh, no, your French is, like, pretty good. Then she notices he has, like, a really nice keychain. Mm -hmm. Remember how she didn't like the keychain that her yeah. boyfriend got? Whatever, this keychain that Raymond had had an R on it, and it was actually given to him on his birthday in the movie by his, like, daughter, okay? And he goes... She's like, I really like your keychain. And he was like, oh, yeah. And she's like, oh, see my boyfriend's keychain? It's, like, really ugly. I don't like it. Yeah. And he was like, oh, I actually sell these. And she's like, oh, my God, really? How much do you sell them for? And he names the same price as the Frisbee. First of all, how does this bitch not learn the first time? He was pissed at how much she spent on the Frisbee. Now she's going to buy a keychain. Yeah. Anyways, he's like, come to my car, and um, I'll sell it to you. And she's like, sure. She's all excited. 
So at first she's like hesitant to get into his car, rightfully so, it's like a weirdo, you know? But then she sees on his dashboard a picture of his family. Mm -hmm. Like he has his wife and his two kids. So like this arms. Yeah, she was like, oh, like he must be like a nice guy. So she sits in his car, okay? And he's like, ha ha, just like does that thing to her face. And then you see her and she's like, and you know, like lights are fading out of her face. Okay, now flashback. We're back to Raymond and Rex in the car, okay? And he was like, he's telling Raymond, that's what I did. I took her. And he was like, okay, I want you. <laughs> he's like, I want you to drink this. And it was like coffee with like sleeping pills in it. And he's like, I need to drink this. And he's like, what's in it? And it was like sleeping pills. And he's like, because I will show you where she is if you drink this. He's like, what, are you going to kill me? And he was like, no, I'm going to show you what happened to her. And he's like, I don't, like, don't want to kill anybody. Like, you know, he keeps saying like he doesn't want to kill people. He doesn't kill anybody. Okay. And so he freaking drinks it, Brittany. First, he's not going to. He, like, runs around in a circle, similar to when he went crazy at the fucking place, the one I told you with his girlfriend. And he, like, runs around and gets all crazy. But then then he runs back to the car, and it's, like, a rainy night, and he just chugs it. He just drinks it. And he was like, ah, I, want to, I need to know what happened to her. Okay? And then um, Raymond puts him in the car. Oh, this is where, are you ready? Do you really want to know what happens? Yes. Okay. So then the scene, his Brittany, he's like, it's dark just like when they were in the tunnel and he Rexford wakes up and he's like turning on this like little like fucking um, lighter and he's in a box in a coffin and Raymond is burying him alive. He buried him alive next to where he buried Swastika. So she was, so yeah, he should have actually just like ended his life as soon as he got near him. Yeah, so he killed him and they're both buried alive. Wow. That's what happened to her. Anyways, that's the story. What'd you think? Sounds like an interesting <laughs> movie. Well, here's the thing that's really messed up. Is she wouldn't have gone so like, oh, I need a new thingy. She went to him. And what he was explaining to like um, Rexford was how it was like fate. It was fate that I was supposed to kidnap her because it was like so easy. It made me but, scared. Anyways, that's the movie. What do you guys think of the movie? Lil' Barry the Swastika. <laughs> <laughs> he said I don't kill anyone physics does <laughs> oh, that's why you don't sim mm. okay so that was a long story but I wanted to tell you about that and it was really it really freaked me out because it was like could you imagine being buried alive that's so scary yeah I think that's most people's one of their worst phobia mm -hmm. All right. the vanishing I know okay. I missed a couple super chats. MK Solid 82 199 super chat. Shorter hair, Venti. Let's do it. Guys, my hair mm -hmm. has too much coil to it. Like, if I even cut off like two inches, it'll just shrink up to my chin. Like, I need the weight to hold it down. My hair, like, look how long my hair is. It goes all the way down here, <laughs> but the shrinkage. So, also, I don't have the face for short hair. You need, there's a certain measurement when you measure it here that if it's beyond that you don't look good with short hair and i don't pass the test so i don't really think i would look good with short hair okay. but it is annoying and there was one more i missed 200 watt studio to our search she was probably cheating on him no that wasn't no she was just kidnapped and then mk solid she had shorter hair you guys are trying to gaslight me so you guys can be like, oh, she hit the wall. That's what you guys are trying to do. Okay. So back to the sewing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let me move the light. So back to the sewing. Um I just You know what I think we're supposed to do? What? Like, I feel like we need to get something to go through here, or is it this part that goes through? Like, we're supposed to. I wish I had more space. Like, like, not have to get up every five seconds. Okay. <sighs> I might, we might have to go to a different school. 
Are you sure you need the little pull to poke through? Mm-hmm. Here. Let me try a different one. Because I'm just going to do it a little bit, too. Because I think that we're supposed to... Okay. Okay, so we do that. But I'm supposed to cut it, but I don't understand. What step are you on? I'm on here, but there's already one in there. So where's the next part? I think you're just supposed to take that one out and put this one in. I think that one's just a sample one. Really? Yeah. So I should take this out? Yeah, I think it's the same thing. Okay. Okay. Maybe you're supposed to have two. I That's what know. I'm thinking. There's supposed to be two. Do you guys know? Is there another instruction manual? Right here, there's a second piece. Deb Copper, thank you for the 9.99 super chat. Oh yeah, there's like a whole bunch of other pieces, I think. Okay, you see this? So now we do that part. Do -do -do. I'm looking up the sewing machine make. Uh, Spool one bobbin with the string. Yeah, but what about the other one? Like is, do we use the second one? Hi. I'm I don't want to I don't want to review. I want to, yeah, instructions. I don't need it to be on. So just turn off the waist. Okay, okay setting okay. the bobbin. Perfect. I did that. I did that. I did not do it like that. Okay, let's redo it. <laughs> okay, we go, go back. Uh -huh. Okay, cool. I'll slow it down for you. This is perfect. This is exactly what we mean. Okay. Okay. Then you take that. Okay. Put it under and then over. Okay. Yeah. And oh. then once you... Do it over. Hold on. I got this. Okay. Okay. Got it. Perfect. <clears throat> I think this piece was. The video stopped working. Mm-mm. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see what it looks if I turn the light behind you off. I feel like it's so dull in here. I don't know, it's even darker. Okay, it's working now. Okay. There you go. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna redo this part right now. Okay. Okay. Pause this. Okay. Cause I do think we need this part. Cause this this is gonna go this is gonna go back in there. I shouldn't have taken it out, but it's okay. That's gonna teach us something in a little bit. So put this here. Lost art. Ow. Ow. Kicking scissors, maybe not the best idea. Ow. Oh, okay. The sewing will start as soon as we. It's starting right now, actually, you guys. We, you, when you unbox the sewing machine, you have to set it up, and we're setting it up right now. Okay, the video is loading. Wait, let me see. I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do it slowly. Okay, I have to press this button. 
That's enough, I think. Did so. the video just stop working again? Yeah, it did. But I, I at least started this a little bit. I fixed it. Is this a part? Oh, yeah. Okay. So. Okay, so they took that out, right? The bobbin? Yeah. From the bottom? Yeah. Which is fine. We have this one now. Okay. Oh, oh no. Fudge. Okay. Where'd it go? Well, good thing we have those scissors because we'll need that. Okay. Okay. Oh, I got it. Do, do, do. Okay, now put that in there. Okay, got it. It froze again. Mm. That's okay. It's tragic women these days have no skills. We're learning. Yeah, it's like, do you know how you get skills? By learning. Yeah. <laughs> That's like going up to someone overweight at the gym and being like, oh, people are so fat these days. Like, Okay, but they're trying to change that. They're trying. Look. Okay. And Lila does know how to sew. She sew sewed things before, but she hasn't set up I've a machine. I've never set up a machine, but I've used one. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So that part, we have that. Okay. We Upper thread. Okay, perfect. So, but like, it still doesn't make sense. Like, where do we... Is it just staying? That doesn't make any sense. Hold on. A man would have done this in two minutes. Oh, well, maybe you should transition. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay, hold on. Maybe, maybe it's supposed to grab it. doesn't make any sense okay then it goes oh okay I see oh there it is okay you have to put it through some sort of Okay, let's do the upper threading part. So we already did this. Someone said I'm gonna get my hair caught in the sewing machine. <laughs> uh, KVLT of gaming um, donated, where'd it go? Oh, donated five Canadian dollars. Hi Lila, I loved your guest appearance on Sam Tripoli podcast. Sam Tripoli, thank you so much for watching. How did that one go? Super good. We talked about American History Voter Fraud and World Death Organization, which is the history of eugenics. Her documentaries, for those of you who don't know. Her and her husband. So, we, we need to figure out this part. Britain, $4. As someone who learned how to sew from a courtier, this hor horrifies me. Well, we're working with what we have right now. Mm-hmm. And it's going great. You guys are so critical. Why don't you try something new and stream it? Why don't Why don't you go do it and see how it feels? Oh, you won't because you're scared of being bad because you're scared of the comments that some of you guys are making. You're not brave enough to deal with that. Okay. What hair products do you use to get that volume? Um, I don't. I have African curly hair, so volume is not the issue. The issue is the frizz. I think it tells me it's this part. But I blow dry my hair upside down. Like I let it air dry for a bit, at least 20 minutes to two oh. or three hours, and then I flip upside down. I figured it out. Look. This is the second part. Okay. This is how to, this is the part to do this. I, I turned the directions over and there's a new set that we're supposed to follow. So. 
<laughs> Amazing. Okay, so, see, look at this picture, Brittany, you see? Hold on, I'm excited. I know how to do this. Okay, so, one. Oh, we flipped this lever. We flip it up. Got it. Hold on, show me in one second. Okay, so this part is just, this is, this first thing we did is just how to fill the spoolie up. The second part is to do the actual sewing. Oh, it's her drying out. Okay. Okay, what thing did you flip up? This. See? Yeah. Flip that up. That okay. does something. Two. It's not in English, but I'll just look at the picture. Two. It's not in English? No. Is this one in English? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one's in English. <laughs> this one's in English. <laughs> Okay, so um, we got an audio desync. Uh, well, there's nothing I can do. Thank you, YouTube app. I can mute and unmute the mic. That's literally all I can do, guys. Is it working now? It just glitches sometimes. Oh, there's filters. What's this one? That was kind of bright. That one's nice. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, there we go. Okay, so this is the first page of the directions, and this is the second page of the directions. And this is how, I'm gonna tell you why this is confusing, because we have two pieces of directions, except this one's in English and this one's in a different language. So I'm gonna throw this one away then. Yeah, that, that one's in French. Menage toi. <laughs> so, we already did the first part of the direction. Oh wait, 200 watt studio, $2. How did he tell the story if he was dead? <sighs> Rexford wasn't dead. Raymond was telling the story. Rexford dies at the end of the movie. He gets buried alive, just like swastika. So, so okay, now we're in part number two. Okay, mark on the wheels, points up. Okay, wait. Oh no, point it down. Oh, what, why no. are we pointing that? No, this is just a thing to like show you what it does. Okay. It goes in and out. Oh, see, look, they could see it in there. Yeah. Okay, that's, it just, that's what it says. Mark on the wheels, points <laughs> up. Needle rises. Pull. You got this? Thank you. Pull up the spool pin completely. Okay, we did that. Okay. Do that same thing. First of all, we need to cut this off. Actually, I'll use this guy. I want to show you guys more of the patches. Yeah, show them the patches while I do this. Patch. This one says where it stops, nobody knows. <laughs> and it has different words on each side. There's the spooling. This one is fear no evil. Okay, pull up this before no. And this, I wanted to, so I wanted to do like a racer kind of theme on something. So that's why I have some okay. racer patches. This one says top 25 and there's, um, I think kanji at the top, Japanese, 1984. Okay. Okay, now we have to put this around like that. Ooh, look at this. This one says coffee in a shape of a gun. I feel like you would like this one. Mm, I do. I like that one a lot, actually. Okay, so... I don't know. Is this... I, I bought this because I thought it looked right. cool, but then I realized people at the gun range have this. Is this, like, stolen valor if I use this? Like, I genuinely just thought it looked cool, but, and I realized after the fact. Okay, hold on. Okay. Five pounds from Dan Holland. Mm -hmm. Why would the French need to sew? You don't need anything sewing for a white flag. Oh, I got it! Ha ha! That's funny. Okay. I did that part. Now, pull the lever. It's another patch I wanted to put on. This one says cryptid research team. I also wanted to do like a paranormal theme. 
jacket maybe. Okay. Hold that. Okay, hold on. This is my favorite one so far. The Starbucks gun one. So wait, what did you do now? You put the thread through the slot yeah. here? Yeah, and then now I have to do this number six, but okay. Reality continues to ruin my life, Patch. This is us the stream, but in your guys' look, perspective. Look what I did. See? Is that right? So you put it through here and, and then... What okay, did you but do? do you see how it has to be like a zigzag? Like you gotta... Let me see. You see? I put, so it goes through there, and then it goes up, and then it goes through there. You see how it's like in there? And then it goes back through the second slot mm -hmm. here? Okay. And then where did you put it? You went under, or? Yeah, I went under, and then I put it in this hole. Okay. Okay. Now, okay, now we have to number eight. Okay, this is my favorite patch that isn't thrifted. It's from Etsy. It's definitely going on the bimbo jacket. No thoughts, head empty. Pull her down completely. $10 super chat from Anthony. I trust Lila set this up. She's smart. Yeah, just Lila. I agree. Area 51, UFO activity. Okay, we need to somehow... Where's that little stick? Oh, no. Where's my stick guy? Right here. Okay, maybe we could use this. Here's yeah. another racing patch. It says um, street smart. Turn around to the I think it's racing patch. Pass the thread under the hook. Oh, this guy comes down for some reason. I love this patch. It's over. I love the Doomer patches with the illustrations. Ooh. This one's from Etsy. Wow, so smart. Another yeah. one from Etsy. Okay. I feel like you would like this one, Lila. This patch. Oh, huh. that's cute. Okay, I'm kind of... This one I thrifted. It was like $10. Taekwondo patch. Okay. Wow. I used to take Taekwondo, so. Really? Ah! Okay, hold on. No, oh, I almost got it. Let me see what you're doing. I'm doing. So you went under and you're wrapping it back around. See, I'm not good with this type of stuff. Okay. okay. This wrapping around business in directions. Okay. This is actually really difficult because now you have. Oh, God, no. Because if it moves too quickly and you don't do it fast enough. You're, you're zigzagging it around so much. I don't know how how I'm supposed to remember this. Oh, it broke! Oh no, it's okay. Oh no, that's not okay. I need more, I need more stringy. Here's another oh, racing God. patch from Etsy. Uh, Etsy. Okay. Test stitch the cold pizza slice. <laughs> Okay, this okay, this is so annoying. So rotate the letter forward, raise the needle the letter level small. Hook the What the hell? Okay, hold on. Okay, like this. It's a lot of free Because oh if you do it <laughs> Okay. Okay, now what? This one says mind, body, no soul. Oh my gosh. You have to... You have to use that... No, we have to... We need a needle. Wait, do we... That is a needle, though, isn't it? Okay, what's this? Pass the thread on the... That has... The pass... As a ginger, I need the no soul patch. Yeah, I think oh it's... Oh my really gosh. Cool. It's a small little thing that's here. I think you guys will like this one. AK, 47. Oh my god, I almost got it! Okay. Brittany, do you see how this works? Can you get it to work before I'm done with the patches? Showing them the patches? I thrifted oh, this one. it keeps breaking. But this was before M&Ms were, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Compromised? So, uh. I don't know if okay. I'm going to be using this patch anymore. Yeah. Just. Okay. I thought this okay. one looked cool. Coca-Cola. Thrifted this one. Oh, this one's another racing one. Kyle Petty. I don't know if that's actually a NASCAR driver. I'm not, like, white enough, but 
I thought it looked cool. I was trying to go for initial D vibe. So. Oh my gosh, Brittany, I did it. Oh, you actually did finish before I finished showing the patches. I got it through the hole, which is so... Let me see. see oh, now. so that little tiny hole you had to get that through? Yep, and I did it. How? I did it, I did it, because I followed the direction. How? <laughs> Wait, how did you do it? With the little thing over there? A little spoolie? No, not with the spoolie. With this machine. You see? It goes through here and there's like a little thingy. Uh -huh. And a little, you see? It's like a tiny hook. It's oh. a small little hook. Okay. I did it! Okay. Now. Now we patch. This one says Youth Trouble. I don't know if I show you guys this one, but I like this one a lot. Okay, let's, let's try to do it. I don't know if it's gonna... You guys like that one. And this one's from Metal Gear. Which one you wanna do? This one's directed. Um, let's just do number one. Number. Let's just do number two. Yeah, number two looks like what you're supposed to use for... Number two or number six look like, a, like you're supposed to patch something. Let me see two and six, two and six. I think number six would be two or six because like I like how it has the dots, like the the small space. Let's try something. Okay. Oh, and this one's cute too. These are my animal patches. We need like a practice one. Look at the kitty patch. Mm, that's cute. Okay, a practice one. I don't know if I have any like ones I'm okay with ruining. Let me see. Not Wait. a patch, like maybe just a piece of cloth. Mm. I have one. What do you have? I saw a piece of cloth that I brought. Mm -mm. It was in that little brown bag that I had. Let's just do a napkin. Why don't you like dolphins? I've never seen someone say they don't like a dolphin. Is it because they rape and pillage their own kind? Because if so, that's really not that different from man. Humankind is just as degenerate as a dolphin. Okay. Hold on. We need just like a... Where is that? What are you looking for? I'm looking for my... It was like a small piece of cloth that we could use for a practice stitch. This is scary. Oh, it's in here. Okay. I have a piece of cloth that we can practice on. Okay. Moment of truth. <gasps> I don't know. This is Do you want me to move the chair out of your way? Okay. Is there a way to make it do this? Or do we have to do it like... What's this for? Isn't this used? Maybe it's this. No, it's definitely, you have to be like, auto, the... No, it's this. But why wouldn't it be automatic? I don't know, it's just not. No, it's, it's working, it's working! <laughs> the stitch is so loose, though. Because you know what? It's, it's not connected to the bottom part, but... <laughs> it poked holes in it. Okay, but let me tie back into the tutorial. Mm -hmm. uh, Two dollars from Marquise Dana suing traditional mulatto dress for Sam Brenton. Who's Sam Brenton? Oh, hey, I'm at the sewing part of the tutorial. Do you want to watch? Yes. Okay. Okay. Now let's start sewing. <laughs> Her voice. Let's start sewing. Okay. Turn the main power switch on. It is. Set the pattern selection dial to straight stitch sewing. Raise what are the these? needle and lift the presser foot to set the fabric. Pass the thread under the presser foot. Okay, we're with her so far. Unless we did this part wrong. I feel like this is supposed to do something. While holding the thread and the fabric with your left hand, turn the hand wheel toward you. To lower the needle into the fabric. So that's what this is for. You lower it first. 
Like once you put it under, you lower it. Oh. I really appreciate the music. I like her nails. When you sew the fabric, adjust the speed with the this spindle control. power. Okay, but uh, we need to know how to make this bottom to part go in correctly because it's just. Hold on, maybe I'll go back to the directions. Okay. Do you guys see why I couldn't do this by myself? Why this is sitting around? Okay, there is. I understand you can iron on most patches. All of these do have the thing on the back to do that, but the last time I did that, my patch fell off. It was really difficult to keep it on, especially if they're thicker there or big patches. There is a certain way to do this. So I want to reinforce it. <gasps> okay, got it. Wow, I'm a genius. Bimbo power. You need to plug it in. It is plugged in. You guys heard it make noises. Let me refresh. Okay, maybe I'm not a <laughs> I'm trying. <laughs> Two hours from s'more. Dolphins get high off blowfish poison. No lie. They just pass the fish around like a bong. That that just makes dolphins interesting intellectuals and artists. Okay, I'm so confused. Okay, hold on. Strong woman, ninety-seven hundred dollars. Thank you very much, strong woman. It's strong women's this stream. Why did you get all these racing patches when you don't have a license and hate driving? Well, actually, I have a license now, but I I don't drive my own car, but I do have a license now. The race is stolen valor, and it personally offends me. Listen. I need to, I'm black though, oh. and black people go fast, just like racing cars. So I feel like it's fine for me to have racing patches because like if I want to steal a car, I need to know how to go real fast. So I actually think it's fine and it's not appropriation. Okay. You need a license, you don't, I didn't know you needed a license to steal cars. <laughs> I mean, you don't need to do anything but breathe in life technically, but. I knew, the point of me saying license is like I know how to drive. So yes, you do. You okay. you need to know how to drive to steal a car. What's going on? Okay, I just had to put it through that. And is that just it? Like just like that? Okay. There's okay, that makes there. sense. Now it's right. Yeah. Okay. Now. Now what? Okay, let's try this again. Now, I guess that piece is in it. You know how you were calling the girl Swastika earlier? So yeah. my chat's actually named Sasha Lamora, and they are a subscriber for two months. Uh -huh. Girls, dolphins love when boys push them through the water. I got pushed by a dolphin once at Atlantis when I was like 10. It's like the only how time I left the country. It's like to Jamaica. This? So it's like, this starts working. Or this, let's try this actually. I think the pedal's supposed to do that. Now. Okay, let me put on the video. It's only me. Oh, I got it. What? Really? Oh. Ah! I did it. <laughs> Yay! Let's see if it works. It, uh. How do you backstitch? Like, you have to know how to be able to go back when you're stitching something. There's like a setting for back stitching. I saw that in the tutorial ones. I don't know. But it actually worked and it stitched on the bottom too. That's cool. And how do you finish a stitch too? It's the other okay. question. Okay, we got the first part on. Let's try a different stitch. Okay. But, okay, look guys. Ta-da! A stitch. Okay. Let's do let's just do number one. Unironically, maybe I should take class. Yeah. Not a bad idea. Okay. Don't want to miss these two cool. Oh my gosh, it's actually working. <gasps> Brittany, this is so exciting. Okay, hold on. I don't know how to go back, but... Oh, hold on. Y'all are never getting married? 
I am married. And Brittany's gonna get married. We're not gonna, even if we never took up sewing in our entire life, we're not gonna, that's not gonna stop you from getting married. This isn't 1960. Okay. Sewing is not that important of a skill. Like sewing by hand a couple of things, like sewing a button, maybe that's useful, but it's not nearly as important as cooking. Like that's way more useful of a skill. Guys care more about that. And as you guys know, I have been Bobistro. And in Lila's case, her husband's Italian, so that's that. Yeah. They're always good cooks. Okay, we set it up. Wanna sew something on a patch? I'm scared. Why? Can we figure out how to end, how to backstitch and how to end the patch? I mean the, the. Okay, fine. These are expensive and they're hard to get. It's going backwards now. Which, what did you plug last for it to do know. that? Is it that? Cause that's how you backstitch, which is necessary if you want to like. I watched tutorial like literally one time. Okay. There has to be a setting. Is it not on the instructions? Let's try this. I, I bet it is that. It looks like it would no, be No, it's that. not that. It's not? Nope. But it's working. We just, okay. Uh, maybe just Google that. What what should I Google in particular? How to make it go backwards. Sewing. Okay, Reverse so, sewing. Here yeah. it is. Okay. Let's try reverse sewing. To sew the fabric in reverse, lower the needle into the starting... Fuck. <sighs> it's not working. <laughs> Can you load can you load this video into your phone? Can you go on YouTube and type it? Okay, I'm gonna it. <laughs> okay, here we go. Lower the presser foot. Lower the presser foot. And when you have slowly. sewn a few stitches, stop the machine. Press the reverse sewing lever and hold it to sew reverse stitches. Oh you ha I you see we almost got screen. it. I just didn't hold it. Remember I was pressing this thing? Yeah. I want to be a bimbo voice tutorial girl. Okay, I figured it out, Brittany. Okay, first, let me just do this really quick. <laughs> now, to, to make it go back, we do this. Ha <laughs> ha! Ooh! Now the last thing is learning how to make it end the stitch. You just do it a few times back and forth. Yeah, but how do you tie it at the end? Just do it back and forth a couple times. Are you sure? I'm serious. Really? I know this is fact. Let me see it. Let me see the claw. Okay. I don't believe you. First of all. I believe in your skill, but that's okay, like, so now, strange to me. Okay, now let me see. I'm going to end it. First of all, this is fact. It just has to cross over itself? That's so yeah, weird. See? Look. Now let me. Okay. That's oddly convenient. Ha -ha! We did it! Yeah. And isn't it great that I brought this piece of cloth? I brought this from home. Yeah, it's smart. See? I like how it's like, look, mommy, look at the art I made. Look at my macaroni art. <laughs> <laughs> look, Brittany, you should hang this up on the wall. Should attach it to like a bag or something. Yes, look. Okay, let's sew something. Okay. Let's sew a patch. <laughs> Epic Duality 1999 Super Chat. Britt, you have the cutest smile. I think Lila is so funny. Thank you. Okay, it's, let's do this one because it's white and we have white. Oh, white on. Um, no, no, I don't want to do that one. Okay, which one do you want to do? Um, let me let me figure out what we. Okay, I think I want to do the hoodie. Okay. <laughs> okay, so here's what happened. <laughs> My hoodie. <laughs> has a stain on it but I don't want to throw it away because it was from pop flex and it was really expensive so I want to put a patch on top of that I don't know which patch yet though definitely like one of the more bimbo ones would be good but I don't want something that's going to clash with my stuff either 
So, I don't think I have a patch small enough to... Mm. But that might not match some of my stuff. Okay. That's the problem with that one. Let's do let's do a purse instead. Okay. <laughs> I'm so happy. Excuse me. We figured out how to do it. Oh, let me put this attachment on too, because this would actually help. I think this. Oh, you know what, Brittany? Where's that little? We can't lose those pieces. What piece? The little spoolie. Mm, okay, so let me explain to them what we learned how to do. Okay. So this is what we learned how to do. Number one, we learned how to put the little spoolie on here to reload it. So you have to reload it, so you put it down into this, the bottom part, so it does the understitching. Then we learned how to put this on and make it go through the needle. I want to put this patch on. Okay, perfect. I don't know where to put it. Okay. I think I want to put it in the middle or something. Um, I don't know if we're able to do that. Is it too thick? It's too. I think. Are you supposed to do it inside out? Inside out. Yeah. No, Brittany, we can't do it in the middle because how are we gonna? Oh, actually, we might be able to. I have an idea. You want it in the middle? Yeah. Okay, I got you. I got you, Sarah. You're gonna have to hold it in the air, though. Where? Hold what? This in the air. Okay. Cause we'll, we have to put it in like this. Okay. Is that a bleach stain? I don't even use bleach. I just washed it and it came out with a stain one day on the hoodie. Okay. Okay, this is so cute. So this is what we'll do like this. You see? Like that. Can but, I drop it or no? Um. No, because I'm gonna have to like okay. move it in here. How am I supposed to do this as one person? Well, okay, let's do, which did should we do? Um, I think either two or six. I think two. Okay. Okay. Let's I want it. it once around and then reverse it too. Okay. One sec, one sec, one sec. Oh. Sorry, my laptop turned off. Let's see chat. Okay, hold on. This is not in the right spot. I wonder if I could give you a coaster or something. You're going to have to move it while I'm... Okay. Come Wait, here. what if we hang it over the edge instead? Like, this part? Wait, you see because what? it's a whole... Okay. Like, do you see what I mean, though? Yes. Like that, instead. One sec. Let me turn it. <laughs> Okay, Brittany, then you want to press the button? Oh my god, I'm scared. Okay. I, this is a two-person job. We might... Do you want me to hold it? No. Okay. Okay, press it a little bit. Okay, no, not too fast. Okay, keep going. Go slow. Why is it not going? Okay, keep going. Okay, not yet. No. No. Okay, go ahead. More. Oh, I guess. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good going. You see how this bag is like yeah. kind of fucked up. Okay, keep going. Wait, do you want to readjust the bag really quick? Like put the needle up a little maybe? No. Okay. Okay. Oh no. Reverse it. We have to take it out. I think we should do a different thing because you see how the back. We need to do like a flat surface. I want to finish it. I want to okay, use fine. this bag. Fine, fine. Keep going. Okay. Keep going. I'll go. Try to go slow. No, go. You have to go harder. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh God! Wait, it's working. The stitching is. <laughs> <laughs> it looks cool though. Hey, it looks like um a design. Okay. It's working. You know what? Just keep going. We're gonna make it like look like it's something cool. Yeah. If we go in a spiral enough, it'll look good. <laughs> 
it's working. Yeah, you're gonna use this bag and cherish it. I will. This is, this is a, a, a piece of art. It's a masterpiece. Keep going. Okay, I think that's good. And then let's do like a back stitch. So in case you guys are wondering why we have to do it like this, it's because Lila is short. So the pedal is like, it, the wire's not long enough, so she can't press it. So this, <laughs> and this needs to be held up. So, and also yeah. because we're using a bag and this bottom part, it's not a flat piece. Okay. Okay. Ready to go. Okay, now we gotta go for it. Okay, go again. Okay, well, one more time. Go back, go back. Okay, keep going. Okay, enough. Now. Are you guys ready for the reveal? Hold on. <laughs> you know what it looks like, Brittany? It looks like um, like one of those const. It looks like a constellation. Yeah. Yeah. Um, someone suggested putting the petal on the box. I did try doing that, guys, with a book tail. Like it's on the floor. <laughs> well, this way we can do it together. What are they saying? Um, get some books. Okay. Can you open the bag still? Yeah. Yeah. We didn't do that bad. Okay, hold on. I gonna. I can't wait to show them. It looks really good. It looks really good. Ta-da! <laughs> and then like show it closer though. <laughs> and then the stitching is just like everywhere. Oh man. Okay. Let's, it looks good though. I mean, let's try something that doesn't, it's not a bag shape. Okay. I know this is working. This is how it looks. What we actually need to do, Brittany, is, okay, we might need to spoolie a different color, like black. Yeah. But let's just practice with something that's white. Like, I bet I can make this one look really nice. Mm. Something, like, that would look good with white. Yeah. I'm trying to see if I have, like, any spare ones. Um, I could get the jacket. Yeah, let's put this on the jacket. I want to use, I don't want to use them in a, no, they're compromised now. Okay. I want to use the <laughs> head empty one. Where did it go? Okay. Where's that head empty one? Here it this is. This one? Yeah. Okay. And then I think the jacket's over here. This is gonna be cute. This one we can do with, maybe we'll do like a cool, let's do like a zigzag switch, number three, cause that'll look kind of like cool. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys how this jacket looks before the patch. So this is how it looks before the patch. Isn't it cute? It's cute. So I think I wanna put the patch like, like somewhere up here, maybe like, I don't want it to get covered. Maybe I should put it over here, but I do like it in the front. Yeah, let's do it in the front because that will be the easiest way to maneuver it. I think right here, do we have a pin thingy? Like a pin, like to mark it? Not, not those, but the ones with the little bubble at the top to mark it? Yes, we do. So you could pin it in, in place. Our, where's our, in our box. It's in our box. Okay. Ah, and you know what? I can use one of these like I'm Thumbelina. I love Thumbelina. Look, you have a Thumbelina thing. Oh gosh. Okay. Deb Copper 999, thank you. <laughs> the message literally says thank you. That's funny. Uh -huh. Okay, here. 200 watts studio, $2. I think you're ready for the leather jacket this? now. This? Yeah, that'll do. This will do. I love this. Okay, I've figured it out, Brittany. I feel like an expert now. I think here would be good. 
Lila needs to control it. Yeah, I feel like that's where Okay, I'll, I'll control it. I got this now. I have my seat. I'm ready. I think like right here. <laughs> you know what the best part is, is I know how to set this thing up. And we could do different colors. We have other spoolies now. Are these other, see? I got another spoolie here, we see? And we gotta remove that. I'm trying That's to put cute. It here. that one pin enough for you? Yeah. Can um, I make sure it's straight though? I'm really excited about this. I think this one's gonna look super duper really cute. Wait, let me see. Let me see it first. I'm gonna put a second pin in it. Okay. And you know what, Brittany? I'm gonna put this up here. I will control it. Oh no! The patch fell off. Where'd it go? Right there. Oh. oh no. Isn't this fun? Can you guys believe we actually built this thing? Put it together. Five dollars <sighs> from Dan, five pounds from Dan Holland. Or is that pronounced quid? I heard someone the other day pronounce like that. How, how, remember back in the day when I had all, all English mods and they would say stuff like felon and quid and all these fancy words. Wait. The jacket doesn't go with the outfit, that's fine. <laughs> Cute. Look how cute that is. You guys want to see the picture? Post it. Post some picture. Picture. I mean, you guys already see us. Never mind. <laughs> okay. Let's see the we figured out the sewing machine. I'm really excited about this. Okay, right there. Where's the second pen? These don't stay in. Oh no, it fell. I got it. Okay. I'm trying to not stab my tit. <laughs> I can't believe we actually did it. I'm so happy, Brittany. I, I'm not gonna lie, I was a little bit concerned. That oh. we weren't gonna be able to do it, but we did. Oh, I, I was sure that you would figure it out. Aw, oh, thanks. Getting this in a so ah! I pitch myself. Oh, I want to get. Um, there we go. I think you should put multiple in there, okay? I'm trying, but they keep like falling out. I'm gonna get the chat a surprise. I'll be right back. Sorry. I could have died, Lila. <laughs> I'm gonna bring the chat a surprise. Okay. Kind of tilted. Did the other pin just fall out? Oh my god. Got a hand sew patches? No, you don't. And you also can't hand sew all of them. Sometimes they're just like too thick. I've tried before. With Sean's patch on his jacket, I had to hand sew that and my hands were literally blue. Let me tell you guys the story of Sean's patch. Do you know what he did? I sew that patch onto his jacket, like just as a gesture of like kindness and giving him the jacket. And it took me so long and my hands were literally bleeding. And you know, the next day I give him the jacket. Hey, this is penguin petals. And this then, is actually a penguin. and then you know what Sean does? He says, oh, I'm gonna rip the patch off. Then when I hand sewed to his jacket, what he was like, I'm gonna rip it off, and I was like, I, I, I sweat blood. I have blood, sweat, and tears from that jacket patch. You're gonna rip it off? I never let him hear the end of it for that. <laughs> Pedals, can you believe we set up the sewing machine? We did it. I'm we losing my it. mind with these like dumb pins. Is it not working? No, they keep falling out. Mm -hmm. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys the penguin. Penguin cat, penguin cat. This is a penguin cat, penguin cat. Here is the penguin cat. Petals. Okay, bye, petals.
Okay, I'll help you. Okay, so I'm gonna hold it out. Okay, wait, wait, let me see where it goes. Let me see where it goes first. Okay. So did Sean actually rip out? No, he was, he was trying to. He literally yeah. was like, I'm gonna rip this out and was trying to rip it out. Mm. So I want it like this. So can, mm. you, can you push the pins in? Mm -hmm. No, not with the pizza hands. I have nothing. No. Wow. No. no. Okay, it's clean now. Okay, it's clean. I'm serious. It's okay. Clean. Um, we need like um. You know what we need? Brittany, I could do this. I could make it straight without these. Are you sure? I'm sure. I got it. But I just want it on the right place because if you put it too far in, you can't see the patch because it no. folds over here. It'll, then we'll fold it and we'll put it where it's not folded. Oh, I just, I stabbed myself in this. Okay, guys. Like, I want it. Do you want it where it's not like that? So we have to put it a little bit outer, like that. Okay. So, don't worry, don't worry. Everything's gonna be great. We gotta. So this thing, see, right yeah. there. Okay, so there's my little thing. Okay, one second. Gonna put it down in here. Someone said Lila, just pin it. You can pin it from where it is right now. It's perfect. I can put one in. Okay. It does need it. Yeah, okay, go for it. Maybe we should do a different stitch design. Not the Z one? No, but let me just make it go back. Oh, see? It kind of looks cool, but I can't. Hmm. Maybe we should do just the one. What do you think? Yeah, I think stitch two is fine. It's like a regular dotted straight one versus like the zigzag one that's the same. Oh, no. That looks good. Okay. Are you feeling okay? Yeah. Okay. I'm feeling good about it. Okay. I just have to go slow. Oh, I got it. It's kind of like driving. Yes. It's working now. Oh, I got it. You see, it looks good. Oh, I'm feeling really good about this, Brittany. Look at it. You see, it's straight. This is way better than my last time. Okay, you see this? Someone said the lining's definitely gonna rip. What? What? Why would you say that? What, what did he mean by that, anyways? Brittany, look. It's actually looking really good. They don't know what they're talking about. Okay. Okay. I like how every so often there's always the one person that thinks that my ring that I wear on my hand is an engagement ring. It's on the right hand and they still think that. What? And it's not, not, not only that, but it's tiny. <laughs> like, okay, excuse you. Look, this is working. Do you see it? Do you see how it looks good right there? Yeah, it does actually. Okay. You're doing a good job. Okay. Put on my glasses. I have to put on my glasses so I can see. Okay. These are actually prescription. They're for sewing. Okay. I'm trying to hold the jacket up so you have enough slots. Oh, I know what to do. Let's put on this. Am I away from the wire? No, because now I can be on this. Can you push this down a little bit? Um, just push my body down, like push on that chair. Okay, perfect. Thank you. I don't weigh enough; it won't go down. Okay. You know what's great? My right foot is actually my good foot, and this is the one I use, just like driving. 
damn it. Did you ever use the old-fashioned sewing machine with the foot pedal? Well, this one has a foot this pedal. This one has a foot pedal. You know what? I'm going to do it like... She has to do it by hand because it's like... It's just too difficult. Because we can't get the Here, height right. Here, hold it a little bit. You push it. Again? Yes, but it's fine. Just go slow. Go. <sighs> okay. Go ahead. looking good though he's talking about the pump foot pedal okay the difference Brittany you see how like this one is like perfectly done I had it for a second there yeah okay I'm just gonna try to do that again do this hold on let me maybe okay, hold on we gotta put some, no, no no we gotta put some of this through there Oh, you'd have to pump the foot manually? Oh, like no electricity, okay. Got it. It's working. Oh, I'm feeling good about it. Speaking of Sean's jacket, I have to actually reinforce that patch because I didn't do a good job the first well, time. Well, bring it over here. Yeah. You know, it actually works better if you go faster. 100 hours from Strong Woman 97. Brittany, it looks great! It does look good. Wait, it looks so good. It's okay. pretty good. Hold on. Strong Woman 97, 100 hours. Are you sure the ring on your right hand, you did say you have a trouble telling left from right? Yes. L for left. No, I can tell my left and right hand. It's just like when it's mirrored and then you tell me which one or like directionally, it can get confusing. Like if you say cross your right arm over your left okay. on the ice, that would be hard for me. Can you reverse stitch it? I did already. I reverse stitched it. Oh, okay. I kind of want to do it too much. Okay. Yay. It actually looks really good, guys. Let's see Wait, hold, oh, hold on, hold on. Um, okay, go ahead, be careful, um, okay, let me cut, that's only like the little thing, but, there's one one over here, there's one one, hold on, here, it only did that because I, I only reverse stitched it in this spot, I did it in a small spot, okay, that's why it's like that, otherwise it would look funny. I think it looks good. Let's see. Yay! There it is. Do you like it? Yes. No thoughts, head empty. It looks really cute. It is. And it's in the right spot where you can see it. Yeah. Thank you. Yay! It looks so good. It actually worked, guys. This is how it looks up close. Okay, so Brittany, I want you to see it. You see on like this spot, I did it like really perfectly. Yeah. And then like here, it was almost perfect too. Like right there, because I was like going super fast and I wasn't scared. So when you go fast, it goes straighter? I think so. Okay. But I also think because first of all, the jacket's like really thick, which just makes it difficult to do. And then also, it's a circular thing. I think if we do like something like this, that's square, we could make it easier. I could have sworn I had another girly patch. I think I dropped it somewhere around here. I'm really excited. Oh, the Starbucks one. Where is that yeah. one? Yeah. Want to put that on that too? Yeah, but it's another round one. You're going to hate me. Okay. Well, I'll try it. This one's square. This one could go on this jacket. Okay. Where do you want to put it? Let me see. Mm. I don't know. Uh, four ninety nine super chat for monkey head. Did I miss all the sewing? No. No, we just actually we just started the sewing part. The hard part was putting together the sewing machine. I like it right here. I think it looked good here. 
like underneath the circle. You want to put it underneath? Okay. I just don't know how to align it because I can't see it. Whoop. Hold on. Um, I don't know if it could go underneath because then it'd be maybe like right here. Let me see. It had to be more like here, but that would cover the pocket. Um, yeah, and then it would make you wouldn't be able to put your hand in your pocket. Yeah, hold on. Why can't I put it like Let me here? See. Like, wait, where does the pocket start? I can't feel it. Yeah, it's too close to the pocket. Damn it, we should have put the circle up higher. Let's put it on the other side. It doesn't look right when it's like a circle and a square. Maybe though. we should just okay, maybe we should get a different coat. Maybe like. You would sew the pocket shut. You, gotta, <laughs> yeah. you have to put that on the sleeve. Let's get a different coat. I, Cause then we'd show we we would we would sew the the arm shut. <laughs> More pizza for Lisa. Jacket. It's it's men's size. That's cute. Where do you want to put it? All right. Um, let's see. I think for this jacket, I want to do the red patches. Okay. Most of these go with it. Let me see. Um, so the arm one. Hi, pedals. So pedals is on the ground, rolling around in her penguin hat. I'm just kidding. We took it off of her. <laughs> Imagine if she's just wearing it this whole time. <laughs> Hold on. That one's cute. Put the whole jacket on so I can see. You have a different color thread for that blue jacket. Yeah, it yeah, is kind of dark. We'll have to do this different color thread. So you can watch us from the beginning. I know how to do it. Shall we do it? Do you want to do different thread? I want to do this one. Okay. I think I want to do this one and like. So I think we need black thread. Let me just see where to put it. This is too small. We need coffee. I can make a batch. Yeah. Let's make some coffee. Biker chick chic. And they like cold pizza. And someone was like, coffee, it's 10 p.m. Yeah, but. Okay, mind your business. So what? So what? We like coffee. Okay, great. This is great. Um, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get started on the, so are we done with this white? Yeah. Okay. Brittany, you have to watch me do this. I yeah. am. I'm, I'm just. No, you have to watch me do this part where we put it in the, this part. Okay. Okay. Where is our, oh, here's our little. Okay. What color Black. do you like? Black. Okay. these little ones it can't be the little one mm. black's right there on the little one okay well that's purple oh that's black okay perfect we got a little black one now okay, okay. so first now that i've become a 
sewing kit master. First, we have to fill the spoolie. And the way you do that is you take this, put it in that part, then you go through here. See? Up and around. Up and then around and around. Okay. Okay. Now we need a this. Yeah, a lot all the patches for the most part, except for a couple like this one, um, can be ironed on. But I don't have like that's a lot of work to get an iron out and do so, that. And it's not even strong enough. The first part is we have to fill this up because this is the bottom part, you know, this little part. You can take this and put it in that little hole. Okay, got it. Now we put this here and then we move this. When you move that, what that does is it makes this not go up and down, but it makes it go round and round. Okay. Oh. Ooh. Okay, not too, not too. Oh no. Oh, that's, that's wrong. What happened? Uh, something, something not right happened. Where's the Did you need more string you to know start what? off with? I need, <laughs> I need the direction. Right. Let me, let me go back to this. I'm not quite the master that I thought I was. So. Do you want Starbucks or the quarterings coffee? Oh, I want to try the quarterings. I never tried it before. Okay. 